Red Wing, just about my favorite song of all time. This would be considered a tune of choice. And we're gonna take our time learning this. You can do so many cool things with this tune down the road, but I'm gonna start you out with a basic version that's gonna give you a really good, strong foundation and hopefully get you really inspired to play this tune. As you've been working on in this lesson with practice buddies, intonation is always a thing for us fiddlers but can be easier to check when you have half steps. So in Red Wing, and just right in the opening, we have a spot where we have a half step, and that's a great place to check, am I in tune, are my fingers coming down close enough? So, keep that in mind as you practice it on your own. I'm gonna go ahead and start teaching it. Starts on an up bow with a quarter note, and so repeat after me, one, two, Three. Three. One more time. And we're going to walk it up. So repeat after me. Let's try all that. One, two, three. Up, up, down. Hold, two, three. Good. One more time. Two, three. Hold, two, three. Here's our next half step. We're going to go to a low two. Your two will go in the same spot on both the A and the E. Good, then we, la we add one last note. Good, from the beginning, two, three. note there which kind of takes us to the next section. Try that again. One, two, three. of the A part. Transitioning from that first phrase to the second phrase, we have a half step. So if you start up bow on the B, you're going to go up to the C. That bowing is up, down, Again, two, three. Now, we're going to add a C to a B. Two, three. Notice that bowing. Down, up, up, down. From the first ending of the first phrase again. Two, three. here. He really likes this song, so he's going to join us. Same thing again. Two, three. Up, up, down. I added one note there. Again, two, three. Up, up, down. 
now we're going to do four eighth uh, quarter notes, excuse me. Try that with me. See how it's A and then a scale. Okay, let's put the pieces together from that up bow, two, three. Repeat after me. Again. If I put those together. Together. Go. second phrase starting on the B up bow two three video we'll put all three phrases together now. Putting it together from the beginning. One, two, three. Go a little quicker. One, two, three. And 
in the next video, I'll finish up the part. This last phrase will feel familiar, and then we'll change those four quarter notes to different notes. So we're gonna come from this up bow B. And then it's gonna change. All right, so let's try that again. Two, three. From the open A down to the E, F sharp, D. Put that together. That's it. From the B, two, three. to that G. We're in the key of G and the part resolves to a G. So you see the pattern there. All right, one more time. Two, three. Whole part. One, two, three. Keep in mind, I'm going to teach you the transition right here. We're going to do these four quarter notes. Hold, hold. Then you're going to jump to the G on the E string. So you might get used to hearing that note and noticing that this G, this G, and this G should all sound the same. So if they sound kind of sour, wiggle them around a little bit till they sound the same. Also, just like we've talked about previously, notice how when I come to the two on E, I'm not changing my frame of hand. My hand is framing the fiddle in the same way and my fingers come over. If I were to change it, it would be wrong and it would go like this. So be careful of that. Four quarter notes. <laughs> And then you'll be ready to walk into that second part. Work on this first part quite a bit, and then we'll go into the key of C for the second part.